Good afternoon. This is the Sharp Knife Woman, and I decided to take the opportunity this afternoon to talk to you a little bit about how to dye your craft items uh, with earth pigment paints. And specifically, um, I'm making a pair of Kiowa moccasins. I'm going to show you a picture here. This is a picture. Um, they have really great beaded and uh, coned uppers with cuffs that are beaded and painted. They're painted yellow and green. Before I put the cones on and then start constructing the moccasins, I'm just going to show you how I'm going to paint these moccasins yellow um, because it's pretty important to know exactly how to do that in a way that's going to uh, make them comfortable to wear as well as have that pigment stay in. Now I'm using a powdered pigment um, this is a typical yellow ochre that they would have used and what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by just sprinkling some of it on here and I'm going to take this is actually a piece of paper towel um, often I might use also just an old piece of rag and I'm going to take that and I'm going to start spreading it around as thin as I can because you don't really need a lot of this pigment as you can see it goes pretty far but I'm just going to start rubbing and spreading that pigment throughout the leather. See? Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take and I'm going to give it a good rub because I want to embed that pigment into the fiber. And I'm using brain tan leather, so this really does go in there very well. As you can see, it's covered pretty evenly. Um, I will go back later and clean up the beadwork and so forth, make sure that it's good. But uh, once you shake out some of that, let the wind blow it a little bit. I like to hang it on the clothesline. Um, let the uh, wind take out as much of the loose powder as we can get. That's going to be perfect. And then what I will do is I will go ahead and seal it and I because these are for a commercial customer who wants to wear them and they're going to need to stay yellow. I'm going to go ahead and seal them with a commercial sealant, spray sealant. There's the other one. You can see how those yellow uppers look. So I hope this has been helpful to you. Uh, kind of an impromptu video, but I thought it might be helpful for a few people. So this is a sharp knife woman saying thank you for watching. Take care.